Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brendan. Today we are doing um, another episode, episode number two of the storm walkthrough. Um, today's challenge, no heals because you guys voted for that in Discord. If you want to vote on the challenge of the episode, go and um, click the link to my Discord in the description below. That was um, really great um, plugging right there. Um, but yeah, we are doing no no heals today so i've already taken out all of the heals that i had um not that we had any in because um we've only really just finished the item card only challenge so we are allowed to use lightning bats and thunder snake today if we want to um which is fun if you haven't checked out last episode you should probably do that because it kind of um it kind of describes what what this walkthrough is all about so that's fun um, let's see how long it takes us to get the rune skull because this could take a while did not collect Wow one already nice um, So yeah currently the poll for the next um, episode of the storm walkthrough for the um, challenge is up on my discord as well I didn't think I said that at the start, but yeah I try and put it up just before I start recording the next episode So yeah if in the future I have to record like a whole bunch at once I'll just put up a whole bunch of them all at once so you can like vote on like say I need to record five episodes, I'm away for like five weeks, that will never happen. Um, but if I'm away for like a long time or a time that I can't record a couple of episodes, then I'll put up all of the, all of the, um, all of the polls for those episodes. Generally I like to do a week beforehand, re a week before I record slash they come out because I basically generally record this on the day before it comes out. Okay, we are getting so bad luck, like what is this, seriously? Um, this has taken forever already. This is what, fight number five, I think? Yikes. Big yikes. At least we one-shot that guy. That's always good. Always- Oh, still not- Did not collect. Okay. Um, sometimes the clues as well. <laughs> There's a lot of defeating collect quests here that I just take forever. There we go. We got it. Nice. Amazing. I honestly cannot wait until this area is all updated. Graphics-wise. Like, it's gonna look so cool. I really didn't want to record. As soon as- as soon as I heard that they're updating the graphics here in the next test run, which will probably be dropping sometime really soon, I didn't actually want to record anymore until they finished it, but, like, I need to, unfortunately, uh, because this is going to be a heck of a long um, walkthrough. Like, if we only do one episode a week, which I'm still debating having a couple more extra ones, um, uh, we, we'll see. Um... It will probably take about two years at this at, with the current amount of episodes that have planned which is up until the end of Imperia part 2 so basically the end of the game now in 28 2019 I was about to say 2018 Wow 2019 it's gonna take about two years so that's fun um, we'll see if we can increase the episode count per week um, I don't know if I can too much because these do generally take quite a long time to record uh, mainly because, um, it's just like a, like, <laughs> I'm, last episode was like 33 minutes of just playing the game, um, which is kind of weird, because I don't usually play anymore that much, like, all in a row, like, I mean, I did that for the death walkthrough, but not, like, constantly recording and, like, not having a break, because in the death walkthrough between, like, cuts, I would, like stop the recording software and I would like go and watch YouTube while I was finishing off the rest of the stuff but um now <laughs> nope can't do that I just record the whole way through um which is kind of it, it, it provides something different for me and it's not the same which is nice but also um it means for me at least it feels like it takes longer to record because I'm just sitting there forever um playing the game and talking um, and then have to go through and edit it all, um, which it takes a, a lot longer because it's not as simple as just cutting where, where the video ends and stuff, um, which is what people would call assembly, but, you know, I'm lazy. I'm lazy. Whoa, level, right? Level? Yeah, level. Look at that. Look at us. Go level six. Amazing. We're actually, I actually forget that. Cyclops lane is actually kind of quick. Like, if you can do it really quick and get the drops really quick, it's actually not too long. Um, I think when we recorded the A-Team, it took us about 20 minutes to do. Um, yeah. But I mean, the whole of Wizard City itself, the free-to-play area takes about an hour, I would say, is my estimation. We'll find out when, um, when we get to, uh, Trident Avenue, which is going to be the last street. Spoiler alert. Fun fact, all of the areas, um, like the episode numbers for the areas are laid out in the, um, the opening 
the first postcard of the of the like of the main like the world postcard because obviously in the intro for the series there's like two postcards well two main postcards one for the one for the world and then one for the um episode um and i'm not sure if there's going to be if the others are going to be floating around that we've already done i'm still haven't I, well, you'll see because if it was at the start then you know it obviously is going to be like that but if it isn't then it may not be um so yeah it's completely up for debate really um and i, I don't know yet depends how much i want to edit i guess but yeah basically in the world thing is all of the episodes in order so just so you know what episodes coming up next um all of the areas are in order and then there's also especially for the wizard city one i know there's also the faces of like merlin bros i think halston belstrom and um uh Malister. Because, you know, those are kind of important characters. Hi, Nolan. Hi, Nolan. Oh, look, the Warhorn Pass. We are nearly done already. Um, we need to leave a mark because otherwise I'm going to be walking for ages. I honestly do forget how quick, um, like, Cyclops Lane goes. Like, I don't actually know how long I've been recording. I don't really time these episodes. I did, I did time the death walkthrough. Fun fact, you're getting, like, all the behind the scenes. I don't know if this is going to be cut out. But, um, yeah. The, I do actually time the death walkthrough because I kind of try and make it about 15 minutes or definitely not longer than 15 minutes uh, simply because I don't think it makes a good video if it's longer than 15 minutes especially for like a standard like let's listen to all of the dialogue um, and only do like one boss fight episode sort of stuff I don't think it makes a particularly good episode if um, if it's like f 50 minutes of just me doing the questing like I, if I'm doing that, it has to be kind of all cut up, like this episode, these walkthroughs are, like, all cut up into parts of just the best bits. But, saying that, wow, two fizzles in a row, what is this? What is this witchcraft? Saying that, we can't, you can actually see the full uncut videos if you go to my Discord channel, again, same, shameless self-promotion, really. Um, and you go into the Boogle channel once you've typed slash, um, agree to enter the server. Um, basically just agreeing to the rules. Um, you can, um, you can type exclamation point storm and you can get a list of all of the commands that you can go to to see all of the behind the scenes videos. Um, so that's just like the full uncut video. So if you want to see what I cut out of this episode, which I don't know yet because I'm still recording it obviously and haven't edited it yet. There's probably a lot of stuff that I cut out. I know last time there was a lot of good stuff that I had to cut out to try and keep it like 20 minutes ish. Um... So yeah, if you want to see that, you can go to my Discord and find find them all. They're privated on my, well not privated, they're unlisted on my channel. So you can't actually like search to find them because, I mean, I don't think, I, I don't think it's right. Like having that is just another video. It's kind of a cop out. But if you want to see what I cut or just watch that instead of the actual thing, you can. Um, they are generally really ready. Technically, the day before. The day before they um the episode comes out so like today later today this episode like this uncut video that i'm recording right now is technically already ready and up on the channel and the command would already work um that's a wee little cheeky bit but you know if you want to watch the full bit or you just want to watch the cutout bit if you don't have enough time because these could be a long a lot longer in the future like i'm talking hours because i know chrysalis is going to be a pain a big pain um, well, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. We didn't even get it anyway. Um, definitely didn't fizzle like five million times like we did the previous fight, which is always nice. I really don't like them. This f this always takes me forever. Like, no matter what, no matter how well I've done with all of the previous quests, this fight always takes so long. Also, I'm really proud that we haven't needed to heal yet. I'm really proud of that. I'm just worried about the final boss fight, really, with General Achilles. He's usually quite a challenging foe um me and him go back a long way from him destroying me on the death walkthrough like multiple times um but yeah we also do have an advantage because we are storms so we one do a lot of damage and two we also boost on them so as long as they don't shield we're like really good um yeah which is also why trident avenues last because then hopefully by then i have the prism also if you have any other things that you'd like to see my storm do um obviously i'm trying to do all of the side quests i don't know about badges yet Still to decide on that, um, mainly because my death is doing that currently, so I don't know if I want to grind out for the same badges again, um, all over again, um, 
But if there's anything else you want to see my Storm Wizard do eventually, um, let me know in the, down in the comments. I'm always open to suggestions um, about what you would love to see my characters do. Same with uh, my myth or my... We don't talk about my balance or my death, really. If you have anything else you would want to see those two characters do, you should let me know in the comments as well because I'm always... Always love to hear what you want to see. Can we please get the Warhorn Pass? Like, seriously? Like, what is this? What is this luck? <laughs> we have been at here more longer. We've spent at least half our time fighting things for defeating collect quests. Like, what is this? <laughs> what is this? No fizzle. Yay. So good. Okay, 117. Bad. You're bad, mate. You're bad. You're done bad. Okay. Thunder Snake again, because the only spell we use is Thunder Snake, apparently. <clears throat> um, okay. Okie dokie. 88 damage. Nice. And Thunder Snake. That did max. Good. 139. Not too bad. Just need to hit him off with a, uh, a minus spark, and all should be good. I am trying to save mana because. Mana is the one thing that you seem to run out of really, really quickly. Especially in the early game. Um, you're more likely to run out of mana than you are health, especially in these quests. Because there's just an abundance of health wisps, but not an abundance of mana. Can we seriously get this? Like, what the heck? Why is this taking so long? So, all is good. GG, boys. GG, we did it. We finally collected it. Wow, that only took 5 million years. Okay, here we go. General Achilles, let's go, boy. No heals. No heals, limited mana. We can do this. I believe. I believe in us. Uh, we're not going to use this. He has so much health, though. 470. What the heck? What the what? Um, I'm going to try and get out the Cyclops Legionnaire first. Probably the best idea. This Legionnaire should be dead. We are nearly at a quarter health down, which is not the best. We probably will, with this, be at a quarter health down. We just need to then go hardcore on what's-his-face here. General Achilles. We fizzled. Unlucky. Of course we did. Yup, that happens. I could go for a minor spark on him um, into a Tempest. I think that's probably what we're going to have to do. That'll be the move, I think. Just because I don't really want to die. Okay, we're at 64 health. This could be bad. Hopefully, they both fizzle. Like, hopefully, they both fizzle. We're also going second, which is not cool. Really not cool. Please fizzle. Please fizzle. Please fizzle. No! We're dead. This does so much damage. Yeah, we did. Oh, no. No! Sad reacts only. Well, we died once to Rattlebones. We died once to this guy. We'll try and get out the Legionnaire, the minion, first. Wow, okay. Already a fizzle. At least we're going first this time. At least we're going first. That's always a good start. Always a good thing when you're going first. They haven't hit me yet, which is also great. So, we didn't hit them. They didn't hit us. Hopefully... I mean, we could just do this and kill. Yeah, we'll do this and kill the minion. Um, because that, that works. We fizzled again. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it! Why do we fizzle so much? Storm, why are you bad? He fizzled. Can he fizzle? No, he's not going to fizzle. That's unfortunate. Fire Cat isn't too bad, though. Fire Cat isn't too bad. If it did 98, that's the minimum. The minimum it could do. Um, I really actually should have taken off my pet because it can heal. I didn't actually think about that. <laughs> Let's just hope it doesn't. Luckily, it's behaved. This, um... Luckily, it's behaved so far and has not healed. I know I said I wouldn't use this, but this is just to get them down. At least the minion out. Because we've tried three times now to get the minion out, so, I mean, <laughs> might as well. We can always go for, like, a Thunder Snake into a Thunder Snake, because that's what we know how to spam these days. <laughs> Thunder Snake. Um, okay, that did so much. Holy moly. Just as well I got the minion out. Jeez. Uh, yeah, Thunder Snake into a Thunder Snake. will probably kill, unless this kills and does max. If it does max, it might kill. If not, then that's unfortunate. Did not. Did not kill. 117. Weak. Super weak. Okay, Fizzle. Good job. Good job, bud. Good job. Good job. Um, what goes around comes around. 71. We need another Thunder Snake. If we Fizzle this, 
Could be game over. We didn't. It's GG. We did it. GG, boys. Hopefully this kills. Yeah, he did. Yeah, cool. Nice work. We did it. Only died once, which is great. You have defeated me. Um, accuracy. Yeah, I think we need that one accuracy. It's better than one damage, two damage or something. Um, Nolan. Yep, let's go back to you, boy. Go back to Nolan Stormy Pants, even though that's not his name. And then we will talk to, um, Mr. Mr. Ambrose of Merle. Um, but yeah, let us talk to Merle and then end off the episode here. With a level... See, we did it. We, we leveled up. Look at us go. Level 6. Level 7, actually. We can learn a new spell. Amazing. We will be doing all of the spell quests with dialogue, just so you know. Just like we did with the, um, death walkthrough. Just because I like doing the spell quests. Um... So yeah, if it's got if it's a spell quest with dialogue, we will do it. Otherwise, if it's just a normal spell, which I don't think it is, no, it is actually a normal certain thing. So we'll be doing that next time. Thank you for watching. Um, remember to leave a like and subscribe if you're subscribe. Press the bell so you know exactly when I post another storm walkthrough. And remember, craft outside the box.